गुड मॉर्निंग लेडीज एंड जेंटलमैन मैं आई रिक्वेस्ट द डेलीगेट टू प्लीज बी सीटेड सो दैट वी कैन कमेंस द सेशन गुड मॉर्निंग गुड मॉर्निंग टू वन एंड ऑल योर एक्सलेंसी मिस्टर ओरहान यलमिन ओकिन कॉन्सुल जनरल फ्रॉम द कॉन्सुलेट जनरल ऑफ टर्की हैदराबाद madam holia gedek chairperson of turkey india business council our friend from the consulate office in mumbai and all the delegates all our friends visiting from turkey as well as our uh, members of ftcci very warm welcome to each one of you for the information of uh, the guest who are visiting us and also there are some new uh, new members from the ftcci so just for your information the ftcci is a 105 year old apex chamber in the state of telangana we started as a deccan chamber and today we call the federation of telangana chamber we cater to over 25000 businesses in the state we work very closely with the state government with the central government we try to also organize many programs events throughout the year almost 120 150 events in a year which primarily are uh, for the benefits of our members how they can get bigger markets and this event is also one such kind where we trying to facilitate the b2b meetings between our members and the uh, delegates so uh, we are confident that this event will be extremely useful and beneficial for each one of you and uh, before we uh, start the event we would like to show a short film of ftcci which will give you an overview of our federation thank you now i request uh, 
uh, Mr. Suresh Kumar Singhal, our Vice President of FTCA, to welcome the guest with a plant. Thank you. Thank you for your presentation. I request Vice President FTC say to address the Guardian. His Excellency. Mr. Orhan Yalman Okan, Turkish Consulate General, Hyderabad. Mrs. Hulia Gedik, Chairperson, Turkish India Business Council, Turkey. Mr. Chakravarti, AVPS, Chairman, International Trade and Business Relations Committee, FTCCI. My fellow industry and trade members, distinguished guests, ladies and gentlemen. Very good morning to all of you. On behalf of Federation of Telangana, Chamber of Commerce and Industry, I am delighted to welcome you all to today's business match uh, making meetings with Turkey business delegates. My special welcome to His Excellency, Mr. Oram Yalman Okan and Turkey delegates to FTCCI Hyderabad Telangana. To all our members and FTCCI, it is a great opportunity and privilege for us to have Turkey delegates to come as a team for the business matchmaking meeting. Dear Turkey delegates, the FTCCI has been playing a key role in the growth and development of industry and trade in Telangana since its inception in 1917. We are proud to say that we are a 105 years old organization, Centenary Chamber of Commerce in Hyderabad. It has been nurtured by many stalwarts of our industry and commerce of Telangana, brought this uh, organization to achieve manifold uh, glories. With diverse industry background, connecting almost all the industries through our members network. We have 20 expert committees to represent the major industry segment like environment committee, GST committee, and so on. FTC, FTCCI is representing the face of industry in leading in trade uh, monitoring and has been playing an active role in the economic development of the Telangana state. FTCCI has been working very close with the various country diplomats, council general and embassies to promote the trade between the countries by organizing interaction meeting with all business delegations on a regular basis. The Indian market, especially Telangana, has been growing consistently and there, is, there are great opportunities to expand trade and investment. The city of Hyderabad has changed a lot in the last two decades. The infrastructure of the city provides, is, provides us 
of global standards recently google is all set to build a, its largest company outside its uh, mountain view headquarters in the us in gachibowli hyderabad amazon web services has invested 2.77 billion dollar foreign direct investment in telangana foreign giants such as facebook google ibm and microsoft have also invested heavily in telangana not only it hyderabad hyderabad is also one of the india's main hubs for the pharmaceutical sector with the city accounting for 30% of the to uh, country's pharmaceutical production productions first domestically developed covid vaccine from hyderabad company bharat biotech has become one of the world's vaccine capitals with four of the five leading vaccine manufacturers in india are from hyderabad hyderabad hosted 800, 800 plus pharma and biotech companies with a valuation of over us dollar 50 billion one of the largest business incubator t hub also is in hyderabad so my dear turkey delegates telangana provides the best business environment and top in ease of doing business specially approvals are provided speedy approvals are provided we are happy to col collaborate and partnership with foreign economic relations board of turkey and signing an agreement with your organization we can cooperate each each other in the field of agri tech education it technologies life sciences pharma real estate and infrastructure energy clean technology aerospace and other similar sectors by adopting new latest technology recently one of the our one of our ftcci member company hollywood shoes has been nominated buying machines program of turkey they are traveling to turkey for business meetings likewise this partnership can help help us to reach the new height in our trade and commerce we can organize these kinds of b2b meetings and delegations on regular manner to increase the bilateral trade between telangana and turkey i wish you all the best for each delegates for their business growth i am sure that our close existing cooperation will continue to grow and grow, uh, flourish in the coming years i once again welcome you and assure you all our best cooperation thank you thank you very much thank you sir now i request mr chakravarty aps chair international trade and business relation committee ftcci to address the audience you know that well what a great day it is uh, my colleague kathi told me just uh, curtail it for half a minute probably but i i will make it uh, extra half a minute then regular well uh, jokes apart uh, it's a great day today as i was telling you what a great day and uh, his excellency <laughs> <laughs> you already started laughing but uh, that's my usual style uh, his excellency mr oran uh, yaman okan what a kind of energy you have what a proactive approach you are not a csa you are you're a, you are a true ambassador of business you are true uh, really that's our key must be very 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 thankful to you because uh, the whole day belongs to you bigger big round of applause to mr okan today but for his but for his initiatives his coordination forgetting that he is an honorable position as a consulate general of uh, turkey in uh, here in india 
he personally coordinates with us and he made sure that things happen i think uh, very few people can match your energy once again uh, hats up to you uh, ms roka and uh, mrs uh, Julia Jedik, uh, my good friend, uh, the chair person of the business club uh, from already. <laughs> May you keep to talking. The to make a friendship, it, it requires moments. It it requires just an eye eye blink, and you you make a friend or four immediately, very easily. That many people don't know, but uh, I I mastered it. Okay, don't worry. <laughs> All right. Uh, Thank you, Ms. Uh, Julia Cherik. Uh, and uh, my good friend uh, Hussein uh, from uh, the Attaché, commercial Attaché, is the most key person for us uh, sitting in Mumbai. Uh, so we'll have more and more coordination with you. And uh, my colleague on the management committee and my vice president, uh, Mr. Suresh Singhal, the man of the day, who is uh, leading the uh, today's program, uh, chairing the today's program on behalf of all of us. Uh, thank you very much, Mr. Uh, Suresh Singhal and uh, the dynamic as usual uh, the only <laughs> the ceo of uh, kathy kathy narwane kathy amol narwane i think it is written here and uh, my good friend uh, bulam sinwas uh, uh, who is actually overviewing all the proceedings today uh, well uh, what can i say about turkey i have a good relation in fact a uh, few few industrialists and a few associations have already have good contact with me they are all members in our international uh, uh, associations which I am associated with and Turkey what can I say the, the colors you like uh, the white you like the red the red what you call kumze 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 yes yes the kumze is known for love and passion the white is known for the transparency and uh, you are so sweet like a Turkish baklavas and you are so so soft like your Turkish towels so so that uh, that uh, in a brief uh, the, that's uh, the turkey we can explain uh, we are very fortunate to have all of you such a big delegation thank you very much for mr Akan once again and uh, today uh, today is just the beginning as we are discussing uh, it will be more and more uh, interactions more and more business exchanges in both the countries as i told you already the india and turkey enjoy close and friendly deep rooted uh, ties way back uh, much before our independence also when the logistics were not happen i was told that there were business relations already the hub of uh, the, it's it's a connectivity between the, uh, we can call very proudly it's an asian country but europeans claim oh it's already there actually it's a hub of european so we are very fortunate to have turkey logistically you are have a great advantage geopolitically also very important player in a volatile region but economically as a hub as a third country exports particularly as a stepping stone into the eu market which which is what it's it's a hub we, we call it is india's relations with turkey are unique and historic as i was mentioning as you already know there are lots of similarities between hyderabad which we belong to the province of telangana the most happening province you will be witnessing that uh, t hub and other uh, zones uh, today you already saw our honorable minister of uh, industry it and urban development uh, mr kt ramarao who is actually uh, the the key driver of the economic growth of our state endorsing the ftcca our federation of telangana chamber of commerce in a big way we we work both hand in hand for the development of the industry and the business here yeah. there's a high level of commitment in both the countries to promote and uh, facilitate uh, the people to people contacts as well the business relations as well and of course the objective of today's meeting uh, is to interact with the turkish delegates uh, thanks once again for bringing such a great delegation and also understand more about turkey and their business requirements with this one on one meeting uh, definitely help us connecting right partner for the businesses for any collaborations in the future or joint ventures to be established between both the countries now we are in a very critical situation post covid but this is the time the happening i've been uh, traveling a lot of european countries for the past three 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 months it is never like before it's a vengeance travel we call we are all traveling and doing business on a business and this is the right ripen time uh, the honorable uh, cj mr vakhan and uh, 
you have come with your delegation all the way once again i must admit that is to be bring new opportunities opportunities among both the parties i once again welcome you and i'm sure the business matchmaking meetings will give an opportunity the businessmen to know the development taking place in turkey and the scope of establishing business cooperation jvs technology import and export and making investments in turkey and hyderabad in mutually a uh, state of telangana as well with that uh, thank you once again i'm also eagerly looking forward to have a great uh, the b2b uh, meetings and interactions once again thanks to you uh, thanks to all the delegates led by you uh, mr bakan thank you all uh, by the way thank you all for the delegates also who came all the way you took your valuable time for the interaction of the today's meeting thank you once again now uh, i request uh, our uh, event partner uh, wtc samshabad uh, i request mr akhilesh director wtc samshabad to address the audience thank you um this is you know this came out of the blue for me so i am not prepared for this okay. any <laughs> okay <laughs> anyhow uh, on behalf of the world trade center shamshabad uh, and visakhapatnam we extend a very warm welcome to the delegation to hyderabad and uh, we hope the meetings are fruitful and uh, lead to meaningful uh, decisions as such and i haven't met uh, his excellency till now but i will be me and have the pleasure of meeting you now after some time and probably the you know uh, we can explore areas of collaboration also with wtc we have a wtc in istanbul which is very proactive and uh, you know uh, we had met couple of uh, the representatives from uh, istanbul in new york last week so we had a meeting over there so yeah and also we are working with the turkish uh, uh, hatchery company uh, who are looking at exploring the market in telangana which is known for poultry so i'm mean, doing some introductions for them so that is what i have to say as of now but yeah very warm, warm welcome from our side thank you thank you akhilesh uh, now i request uh, our uh, delegate head mrs hulia jedik chairperson turkey india business council to address the delegates thank you very much for that one okay thank you uh dear uh, consul general orhan yalman okan and uh, there are a uh, commercial councilor coming from mumbai just to uh, welcome us and also beautiful kiati and also uh let me uh, mr kumar and my friend uh, <laughs> and it's very difficult to pronounce your name so okay and uh, so uh, good morning for everyone so today we just arrived from yeni uh, from new delhi here and we woke up at about uh, 3:30 to reach the plane at 7 am to be able to be here this morning together with you and uh, i'm the chairperson of turkish indian business council deik let me introduce uh, deik deik is a, a gateway of business people or private sector to the world so there are uh, 151 business councils at uh, at our organizations Uh, biz uh, indian business council is one of them and um, so uh, we all uh, are uh, actually trying to go to the countries to 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 be able to meet uh, our counterparts and um, because of the pandemic this is the first visit to india for us 
And uh, actually, Hyderabad was not in our program. We wanted to, to visit uh, New Delhi and uh, also uh, Mumbai. But because of the enthusiasm of the Consul General, and we felt that we had to come here and to be able to meet also the business people from Hyderabad because he mentioned about how uh, potential business possibilities there are here in Hyderabad, which we didn't know. And we came here to explore what kind of business opportunities are waiting for us. That's why we are here for. And hoping today with B2B business uh, contacts, we can have a, a good business relations. So we are not here for touristical purpose. We are here to make business with you. And of course, it's not possible to be able to make business just seeing us and meeting us. But if our contacts uh, continues and when we exchange the business cards and if we keep uh, contacting to each other, I believe that uh, many businesses uh, can arise because of our uh, uh, contacts. Uh, and um, this is uh, what we are aiming for. And uh, for the two days we were in New Delhi and we also visited uh, different chamber of industries, chamber of commerce, and FIKI. And we also invested yesterday uh, in West India. And we went to Ministry of Industry and Commerce. So we have had very effective and fruitful uh, contacts uh, for the last two days, hoping that we will be doing the same here in Hyderabad. And Hyderabad, actually, it's a very new city for all of us. We are 12 people here. And uh, all our, uh, my friends, my colleagues are coming from the different uh, sectors, different businesses. And um, hopefully, I mean, this uh, business uh, matchmaking, uh, matchmaking uh, can um, uh, have a good uh, outcome for all of us. And um, so this is what we are here for. We believe that India is incredible. So it's an incredible India and you are incredible people as well. So please find uh, possibilities to make businesses with us. And we all are uh, happy to be here and we are looking forward to making businesses with you. Thank you. Thank you, madam. Thank you for sensitizing our delegates. Now I request uh, today our chief guest, uh, His Excellency, Mr. Oran Elman Okan to address the delegates. Thank you, sir. Thank you very much. Mr. Vice President, Madam Chairperson, <clears throat> Madam CEO, Mr. Chairman, first of all, I would like to thank for your kind words and compliments. You made me proud. Thank you very much. <laughs> Distinguished members of FTCCI and Foreign Economic Relations Board of Turkey. First of all, I would like to express my happiness to see the Turkish and Indian businessmen all together here. Taking this opportunity, I would like to thank Mr. Hülya Gedik, Chairperson of Turkey India Business Council, for taking the Turkish business delegation to Hyderabad. I also would like to express my gratitude to FTCCI, my friends, for their kind hospitality and for this beautiful organization. It's my sincere belief that the meetings that our businessmen will hold today will be very fruitful and promising. As all you know, Turkey and Hyderabad have very special relations. We have deep cultural and historical ties starting from Nizam's time. Now it's up to us to develop our relations more and more on the basis of these exemplary relations. According to my opinion, so far the Turkish business circles have not discovered Telangana enough. Telangana state has a lot to offer in terms of trade and investments. Now it's a great chance for our businessmen from both sides to know more about each other. I am sure this visit, this visit will open new windows and horizons for both sides. 
As our president, Mr. Recep Tayyip Erdogan, and the prime minister of India, Mr. Narendra Modi, expressed during their meeting in September, the trade volume between Turkey and India must reach 20 billion USD. Both Turkey and India are G20 members with their strong and leading economies, and we have that desire and potential to reach that target. As the Consul General of Turkey, I will always be here to support and facilitate your business. And I am sure the MOU that both sides will sign today will also serve as a useful tool to further increase our relations. Thank you very much. Now I request uh, our CEO to lead the MOU ceremony. Thank you. Friends, we are now signing a ceremony between Foreign Economic Relations Board of Turkey with Federation of Telangana Chamber of Commerce. Yes. Yeah, <laughs> <laughs> So uh, for the information of all of you all, uh, FTCCI is signing an MOU with uh, Turkish India Business Council and uh, the whole objective is to promote trade and investment between India and Turkey. So I think with this MOU we'll be able to probably plan an outbound trade delegation also next year with them. So this is just the beginning. Can I also invite? Okay. 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 Okay.